As an embryologist, I really understand the new needs for our patients. And in particular, in fertility preservation, we need to improve our capacity to assess all site after all site retrieval. We need for the benefit of our patient to be able to understand not only the quantity, the maturation stage of the oocyte, but also their potential for the future. I mean, the patient rely on this oocyte to obtain a baby when it will be the right moment. And we need to really to personalize the journey and understand for each patient how many oocytes are needed to have the highest chance to have a baby in the future. We rely today basically on morphology, which is very helpful. We understand the maturation of the oocyte. We can, dis we can deselect oocytes that are not viable, but we need to improve that to better understand the capacity of each oocyte to reach the blastocyst stage. And for this, we are going to use new technology, even empowered with artificial intelligence. We are working hard in the lab to better predict what can happen with this very important material, which are all site collected for fertility preservation in patients that accept, that wants to postpone the moment of reproduction. Mm -hmm.